A young man with a most unusual horse, a veritable buttercup. <laughs> Are you laughing at me, monsieur? I am, fellow. What of it? <laughs> monsieur, I am a Gaston. Nobody laughs at me. <laughs> you think yourself a swordsman? <laughs> we'll see. in his pocket, Master. A letter to Monsieur de Treville in Paris. De Treville? Captain of the King's Musketeers. Indeed. My life's ambition to become a musketeer, Mr. de Treville, but my father's letter of introduction was stolen. Poof! A trifle. Your father and I are old friends. This will get you into the academy. Rochefort! The scoundrel shall not escape me this time. You blundering fool. Have you no manners, boy? Or must I, Athos, teach you a lesson? And how does Mr. Athos propose to teach me what he is so lacking himself? Meet me behind the Luxembourg at noon, and I'll show you. I'll be there ten minutes before. And I dealt with two of the Cardinal's guards. 
the rest of them fled. Goat. My name, sir, is D'Artagnan. And what, pray, do you think you are doing? I'm in a great hurry. I demand satisfaction. At 12 noon, behind the Luxembourg, ask for Porthos. Another. Zooms. He shall pay for this. I see. So what did you do, my dear Aramis? I declined to soil my sword, so I took him by the hair and dangled him, a fellow of no refinement. Allow me, monsieur, your kerchief. Ha, 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 a lady's kerchief. What's her name, Aramis? <laughs> you are deceived, monsieur. The kerchief is not mine. But I saw you drop it. If you call me a liar, young man, I shall be obliged to cut you in small pieces. Behind the Luxembourg at 12 noon precisely. Oh, what have I done? Three jewels in one morning, with three musketeers. so young. Put up your blades, monsieur. She, the cardinal's guard. The king's musketeers dueling again. You know the cardinal's edict. In the name of his eminence, I arrest you. In the name of his majesty, we decline to be arrested by you or any other interfering cardinal's guard. We are five against three. Not three, four. Go, save your skin, young man. Be off with you. <laughs> You're not a musketeer. I may not wear the uniform as yet, but my heart is a musketeer's. On guard! <laughs> Fellow doesn't know a sword to the sink. They never learn, no? And so to lesson number two, the quickness of the point deceives the eye of the belt. Now for lesson number three, try to keep your shirt on at all times. I do. You'll make a musketeer yet. With practice, of course. And a little more attention to the finer points.
roast pork? A toast to the confusion of His Eminence the Cardinal and, and the Cardinal of God. <laughs> Another brawl? Five of my guards set upon, defeated, slain by three musketeers and you? I will not tolerate it! Come on with me. My friend Athos says you have lodgings to rent, monsieur. Have you got room for me? I have, young man. Come, I'll show you. The rent is payable in advance. I'm a little short at the moment. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This is my daughter, Constance, sempstress to Her Majesty the Queen. Mademoiselle. The Queen still dominates the King, Rochefort. Her power must be broken. You have a clever agent, your eminence? I have already sent for her. Ah, my lady. I am at your service, eminence. The Queen's intrigue with the English Duke of Buckingham must be exposed. The Queen confides only in her seamstress Constance. Abduct her and I'll make her talk. See to it, Rochefort, eminence. Mademoiselle Constance, sir, in the name of his enemies, sir, I arrest you. Why? What have I done?
d'Artagnan. Thank you. Pardieu, it's our young friend D'Artagnan. Trouble, my boy? They tried to kidnap Constance. Hm. I catch a whiff of intrigue. We'll discuss it over a stoop of ale. The Cardinal is plotting against Her Majesty. Clearly. We must warn every musketeer in Paris. I have a better plan, milady. You will be going to London. Wait at the Moulin Door on the road north. You will receive further instructions. Mm-hmm. Your Majesty. Yes, yes. What is it, Cardinal? Can't you see I'm busy? About the forthcoming state ball, sire. An excellent opportunity for Her Majesty to wear the magnificent diamonds you gave her. She hasn't worn them for at least a year. Of course she'll wear them. Why shouldn't she? Perhaps because she no longer likes them, Your Majesty. No longer likes them? Nonsense! Where are the diamonds I gave you, madame? The diamonds? Why don't you wear them? I require that you wear them at the ball. What's more, I command it! That'll teach that interfering cardinal. Oh, Constance. What am I to do? I gave the diamonds to the Duke of Buckingham. I know somebody who will help you, Your Majesty. beloved queen is in terrible trouble. Why? What has happened? She'll tell you herself. The queen speak to me? She needs the help of a brave man. We are all here. What can we do? I'll take you to her. Follow me. Wait for me. I'm at your service, Majesty. Go immediately to England, to the Duke of Buckingham. Tell him I must wear the diamond pendants I gave him. The king insists. But take care. The Cardinal will try to stop you. A gracious lady of the most exalted rank needs help. We leave for England. Tonight. Uh -huh. England? 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 Oh. We are on the horns of a dilemma. War with England is imminent. And we are the king's men. Impossible. Duty forbid. Very well. I'll go alone. <laughs>
have had a slight change of heart. And we have come to the conclusion that war with England will have to wait. Mm. Or we'll fight for a lady, even if shady. Or when it's a question of honor. But we're back to the war in a vulgar brawl. We're, we're all for one, one and one for all. <laughs> short ride to Calais. This way, guards. There's always time for a roast chicken. <laughs> private room innkeeper and keep your mouth shut. Oh, follow me, sir. Milady, it is as I thought. The Queen gave the diamonds to the English Duke of Buckingham. She has sent a young man by name D'Artagnan to recover the diamonds. You will get there first. How you obtain them is your own business. But you must move Listen. The Cardinal. Just bring me the diamonds. You will be amply rewarded. You may kiss the ring with my blessing. Your Eminence. You, for you, my curse. then another vulgar brawl I think rush from <laughs> <laughs> 
Even a cardinal's guard could miss such a target. To Calais! Now, you take a third. Ready? Right on! Leave me! I am taken!
confusing. So, madame, you dance rather well. Your Grace, it's of the greatest urgency. A certain lady has sent me to request the return of the casket of diamonds she gave you. My dear fellow, of course. I have them here. Take them to her with my deepest devotion. Again, too missing. Now, who? Who but the Cardinal's agent? 
It must have been Milady. Never fear, my dear chap. I know a jeweler who will soon replace the wheel fox, the cardinal, yet. Verily, my feet are killing me. War with the English is imminent, sire, and will crush their fleet in the channel. And I'll crush yours there. Indeed? Check to the Queen. <laughs> you crafty old thing, you. I've still got my finger on it. Nervous, sire? There goes your castle. <laughs> A trap. So much for your queen, sire. Oh dear. Try that. Holly. All is not lost. Wait! You cheated!
My jeweler's done a jolly good job, D'Artagnan. Here. He's made two perfect copies of the stolen pendants. There. Get you back to France and Her Majesty with the completed set. Thank you, Your Grace. I pray I am in time. Only two? I was almost caught, Eminence. Ah. Well, two will do to unmask the queen. Beware, d'Artagnan. <laughs> in France. Friend, I was waiting for you. We have reason to believe there's a spy in the vicinity. Poor Porthos. You'll never eat this mountain of food alone. We'll help you. More food and wine for my friend.
Domino's roast pie. The familiar fragrance. You are under arrest. Platinum guards. Hurry, little owl. <laughs> And them, my lads. it means the road to Paris is blocked. I fancy there's another route to beyond. Let them pass, then we'll make for the ruined tower of Saint-Gervais and consult. Now let's see, we're here, Saint-Gervais. The road to Paris is here. We must be there by this evening. I think the time has come for a snack. A leg of cold turkey, a glass of wine. <coughs> Was that your stomach, Aramis? Certainly not. It was yours. <laughs> Every time I sit down to a meal, that bird appears. He's trying to warn us. It's the English army. We're being attacked. Seem to be surrounded. There's been a bloody battle here already. We could use some of those muskets. These we certainly could. Huh? <laughs> Gravity plus wind resistance. 
plus the square root of x minus y cubed. the gods. On D'Artagnan, we'll keep up with it. Put an end to you for good.
Monsieur de Rochefort. Well. Oh. Your Majesty. D'Artagnan, D'Artagnan. The diamonds, Your Majesty. All of them. Accept the Queen's thanks, D'Artagnan. You have saved my honor. The Queen seems a little late, sire. Perhaps she has mislaid her diamonds. Mislaid? Nonsense, nonsense. Why doesn't she wear her rubies, then? It's my command that she wears the diamonds. I doubt if she'll wear them tonight. Wrong again, Eminence. Look, she's wearing them. <laughs> Shall we begin the ball? <laughs> It's the 
Just for Kids videos and send us the proof of purchase for each, along with this card to Just for Kids, P.O. Box 4112, Woodland Hills, California, 91367. That's all you have to do, and we'll send you a free Just for Kids video featuring some of our most popular characters. Be sure to look for these other Just for Kids videos in your store. See you next time. We're proud to announce the home video premiere of a beautifully animated theatrical feature film celebrating the life and times of one of the mightiest folklore heroes ever. Hey, what was your name again? My name? They call me John. John the Fearless. The Rocky of his day, he fearlessly laughs in the face of all forms of danger. From thieves in the street mean barnyard dogs, to graveyard ghosts, to knights in full armor. the joy of everyone, he laughs in the face of a knight in no armor. Escaping imprisonment for a crime he was tricked into committing, he sets out to defend all others as poor and oppressed as he. Good day, my name is John the Fearless, and today I will take Raphael's place. I will fight ball, mm -hmm. and happily. A duel only decides who is the stronger of the duelists, not guilt or innocence. I will fight for justice. But he soon finds that to give is to receive, and his first great reward is the heartwarming friendship of a lovable little serf named Dokus, who, while meek and weak at first, grows in courage and strength with each passing challenge. You just keep back or else! Yeah. Whoa. 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 Kill somebody! Let's go! Run! And before their journey is over, both our heroes will learn that the greatest prize of all is simply to love and be loved in return. So sound the trumpets, stand up and cheer, and spread the good word that the story of the year is here. The heroic adventures of John the Fearless, exclusively from Just for Kids. 36 and 7 times 6 is uh, 40. Uh, no. <laughs> now listen here, folks. My name is Tom Sawyer. I don't want to be no doctor or no lawyer. Fish my river, that's the only place to be. I want to be free sitting under a tree. That's me. 